is uh, Matthew Garrett, who is talking about uh, community hate time. Um, presumably, is that to do with hating the freedom or just hating the community? Oh, that's good, because we all hate the community. <laughs> My name is Matthew Garrett. Uh, you may know me from such previous events as Plug Radio Live. <laughs> I'm here briefly to talk about how much I hate the Lilith community. Now, this may seem a controversial statement. The Lilith community has a lot going for it. My major issue with the Lilith community is that the Lilith community is very, very bad at telling people that they're being dicks. This ties to an extent into what Emma was saying in her presentation earlier. Don't be a dick. You would think that this would be a nice, straightforward rule for people to follow. But of course, we're all geeks, we're all completely socially inept. The real lesson to be learned here is that when people tell you you're being a dick, the immediate response should not be, no I'm not. The immediate response should also not be, I'm going to set fire to your face. <laughs> In itself, that is an example of being a dick, and we just said, don't do that. Those of you who have, at various points in your life, been told that you're being a dick, this is okay, it's fine, we all understand if you're a dick, as long as you're perfectly happy to try not to do that in the future. So I'm going to run over a quick few ways of, um, a, quick few, a few quick situations that I've seen in the past year or so of the open source community. Uh, right, so one of them. If somebody tells you that the joke you've just told is offensive, the correct response is along the lines of, sorry, can you help me try to avoid the situation in the future? The situation is not, you don't have a sense, the, sorry, the correct answer is not, you do not have a sense of humour, and by the way, grow up. Uh, there may be some people in the audience here who are at this point thinking that I'm some kind of junk flaming hypocrite because I often say things that offend people. The difference is, I'm doing that deliberately. I'm a professional. <laughs> not say. Uh, do not use rape as an analogy for something that has been done to your FSTAT file. <laughs> One of these things can be fixed with a text editor. <laughs> if you're on a bus and uh, say you happen to find that sitting opposite you on the bus is an attractive woman wearing a reasonably short skirt uh, with her legs arranged in such a way that you could perhaps if you try hard enough, see someone's up that skirt. The great thing to do is, uh, I'm not actually sure what the completely correct thing to do is here, but one thing that you should not do is take a picture of that with your camera phone and then post it to Planet Fedora. <laughs> Along with a brief statement saying, oh, this was just my camera phone. Uh, think what I could have done with a bit more time to prop a camera, uh, but I didn't want to get my camera out in case I scared her. <laughs> That's also doing it wrong. Don't do that. Uh, and yeah, this one again. If you're hugging somebody and they say, stop hugging me or I'm going to punch you in the face. If 30 seconds later you find that you've just been punched in the face, this perhaps indicates that you were doing something viciously wrong. <laughs> But my real concern with the Lutz community is not so much that people do these kind of things, it's that there seems to be very few people willing to stand up and say, you're being a dick. We need people to be willing to say, you're being a dick, and we need other people to support people telling people they're being a dick, and there's probably another level of indirection involved as well somewhere. But don't be afraid to tell people they're being dicks, and uh, if you're told you're a dick, then think about why that's been told, uh, why somebody has said this to you as opposed to becoming immediately defensive. Thank you.